Hi, I'm Taylor Simone. And I'm Will Curtis. And this is Herndon News You Can Use for November 18th to November 25th. How was your weekend? I actually had a really good weekend, despite the cold. <laughs> how, how was yours? It was great. It was great. It was cold, but it was a yeah, good weekend. Yeah, it was definitely pretty chilly. <laughs> Speaking of this weekend, on Saturday, November 25th, there is the Herndon Turkey Trots. It's at the Herndon Community Center at 4 p.m. And it's a, it's a 5K, so you're running all around the, gov all around the golf course. Pre-registration is $20 for an adult or youth with a can of food through 12 p.m. on November 21st. And race day is $25 bucks for adults and $20 for youth, and you still got to bring a can of food. And the point of having a food is that at the end of the day, all food will be donated to Link. Let your voice be heard. The Herndon Parks and Recreation Department invites you to participate in a focus group to help your department understand you and your family's recreation and fitness programs and faculty needs. Attend one or both fitness groups, but spaces are limited. On Wednesday, November 19th, from 7 to 8.30 p.m., discuss programs offered by Herndon PR Department, and on Thursday, November 20th, from 7 to 8.30 p.m., discuss the Herndon Community Center and services. Focus groups will be held at the Herndon Community Center, 814 Her Ferndale Avenue, Herndon, Virginia, 20170. Participants will receive a small token of your appreciation for their time. Child care will, will be provided for children 12 months and older. To RSV, please email pr at herndon-va.gov. Town closings this week kick in. Um, the town hall on Thursday, November 27th. Town offices are closed on Friday, November 28th and they're closed all across the board. Herndon Community Center on Thursday, November 27th is closed, and on Friday the 28th it is also closed. It's open, my, my part is open from 8 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. The Herndon Centennial Golf Course on Thursday, November 27th is open from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. on Friday, and November 28th, 2014, it's open from 8 a.m. until dark. Friday on the 21st, a float night happens. Yeah, we're going to float at the Herndon Community Center pool. Swampson will be out to play from 6 p.m. until closing. Play on Swampson and bring your floats and toys and have fun with your whole family. With all this cold weather, like, all you need to do is, like, pour. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to sit in that hot tub for a few hours if I can make it. Yeah, pour, like, <laughs> water on the concrete. You don't have ice. <laughs> like... <laughs> it's, I'm definitely I'm, I'm missing the pool right about now because it I think today it was a at least the first time it was 20 degrees with wind chill so that's that's scary we we had cold men winters coming <laughs> it's already here and it's and the sad part is it's not even December yet. <laughs> it's not even December <laughs> yeah but hey are you ready for basketball because with all this cold weather it's basketball season and at 10 a.m. this Saturday watch the varsity the JV varsity girls basketball team versus Her Heritage High School, and it is a scrimmage. And at 12 p.m., watch the girls' varsity basketball team take on Heritage High School, and as well, again, it is a scrimmage. And at 4 p.m., watch the Herndon High School freshman basketball team versus the Heritage High School, and it's a scrimmage as well. On Thursday, November, 24, or November 20th, from 10 a.m. and 1 p.m., there are one-hour performances of the classic ballet, The Nutcracker including all kinds of costumes, choreography, Tchaikovsky's original music, and a fun photo opportunity. It's performed by preschool and kindergarten aged children, so it's going to be a family fun show. Reservation is required, and it's a classical ballet theater at 320 Victory Drive, Herndon. It is free, however, so as long as you reserve your seats, it's completely free. And since the holidays are approaching us, come join the Homes Tour from December 6th to December 7th at 10 a.m., to December 7th at 4 p.m. The tour begins at 777 Lynn Street, Herndon, Virginia, and tour five beautiful homes in Herndon. All homes are within one, mi with one, within one mile of each other. Excuse me. The tour also includes a rest stop at Herndon's Art Space. At Herndon's Art Space. So buy your tickets at Herndon Floors or Herndon Community Center, and it's only $15 through November 30th. Well, that's our show for today. We actually have an interview that Taylor did for the 50th anniversary of the Community Center coming right after this. Right. My name is Taylor Simone. I'm Will Curtis, and, and thank you for watching. See you next time.
Hi, it's Taylor Simone, and I am here at the Herndon Community Center's 35th anniversary. I'm going to talk to Abby Kimball, the marketing specialist. I'm going to talk to DJ Dynasty and see some inflatable balloon games, as well as go to the outside balloon games and go to a Zumba class and learn about diabetes. Join me because it is going to be so much fun. Hi, with me is Abby, and she is the marketing specialist here at the Herndon Community Center. So how's it going, Abby? It's going great. We have a wonderful turnout today, and we have beautiful weather, so it's just nice to have people here in the building. That's great. Can you tell me a little bit about um, what's going on today? Sure. We have an open house celebrating our 35th anniversary. We've been here serving the community now for over 35 years. Um, the Parks and Recreation Department is housed in the Herndon Community Center. We have an aquatic facility. We have a fitness room. We have fitness and, and wellness classes and recreation classes. And we're highlighting those opportunities for people to come out and give them a try today. Hi, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Thank you. Um, what's your name? Hi, I'm DJ Dynasty. Okay. So, can you tell me what you're doing today, DJ Dynasty? Sure. I will be playing um, some great music, some child-friendly music, family fun um, music for the Herndon Community Center, the 35th annual anniversary, which I'm excited to have been invited to perform at. That's excellent. So, can you tell me like a little bit, bit like a little bit about yourself? You've been having fun today. Absolutely. I've been DJing for about 13 years. I just came to this area, the Herndon area, about a year and a half ago. So, um, so far, so good. I'm really enjoying myself. That's great. Like, can you tell me what you've seen so far today at the um, anniversary? Sure. We have our. Sure, there's a balloon twister here. We have some inflatable jumpy houses. I heard, I haven't been there yet, but in the swimming pool, there's an inflatable Viking ship something for everyone to, to play around on. So, sounds pretty exciting. Jane Granis. I'm a personal trainer here at the Community Center. Oh, that's awesome. So can you tell us about your table? Sure. We are actually promoting a Diabetes Stops Here class, and it is geared toward people who are either at high risk for prediabetes, have been diagnosed with prediabetes, or even potentially have diabetes. Um, the class is basically combining nutrition and personal training and exercise, two very important factors in helping to prevent prediabetes and diabetes. And the table is really just a demonstration of how sugar sneaks into our diet and, and 
and how many amounts that we're not necessarily thinking about when we consume these foods. So for example, I have a little um, demonstration here with the Snickers bar. Um, this is how much sugar is in a Snickers bar, and this is how many carrots you could eat for the same amount of sugar um, for that food. Now obviously everybody knows there's a lot of sugar in a candy bar, and everybody knows there's a lot of sugar in a soda, a cola. Same thing here, that's a lot of carrots you could, you could eat for the same amount of sugar that's in one can of soda. Um, but people don't often realize where sugar sneaks in in other parts of the diet in pre prepared food. So for example, in something like salad dressing or ketchup, we've got only two tablespoons of salad dressing here and it's got two cubes of sugar and you could um, have that many carrots for just such a small amount of salad dressing. So it's just bringing awareness to how important the diet piece of it is to helping prevent prediabetes. Um, and we sort of incorporate and tackle the subject both with exercise and nutrition. Wow, so I mean, I love soda. So is there an, an alternate drink for me since I don't want to eat that many carrots? <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, I think it's really about um, moderation and also about changing or getting used to certain expectation for taste. So I think the hardest people, the hardest thing for people is getting used to not drinking so much soda and I have to say that's really more about being um, open to a lifestyle change and we're not saying don't have soda but be aware of how much there is. Um, so as far as alternates, um, you know there's soda that uh, there's artificial sweeteners, there's natural sweeteners that use soda. Um, so those are always an option. Water is a great replacement. I mean, not as exciting, obviously, as a soda. Um, juices do tend to have a lot of sugar, so my recommendation is if people do like juice, they water it down, at least with half water, half soda. It's a great way to cut down. Um, and then back to the lifestyle change is really sort of getting used to the taste of things that are not so sweet all the time. Inherently, they're just better for you. What's your name? Mickey. Mickey. Um, my name is Taylor Simone. Um, did you enjoy yourself today? Yes, it's very fun and uh, I brought all my kids here. They had a great time. They're still spending some time here and it's very friendly. I mean, there's uh, all kind of activity for the kids. Uh, we really enjoyed it. That's great. Would you come back again? Oh, definitely. Uh, we just find out a lot of the classes here and that fits all the family member. Uh, for the little one, our adult, and the seniors as well. So, yes, we definitely will be back and signing more classes here, spend a quality time.